my channel. It is finally my favorite time of the whole entire year and my favorite videos that I ever make and that is what I got my kids for Christmas. Oh my gosh, I'm ridiculous, I know. But I love Christmas. It's my favorite thing in the entire world and it's here. I cannot be, I cannot tell you how excited I am to finally be filming these videos. I've been getting lots of comments from you guys asking when they're coming and today is the day. I'm starting out with this series with my daughter Addison's Christmas presents. She's eight years old and in this video you will see everything that she's getting for under the tree. So, if you have a little girl in your life and you need some ideas, hopefully this video can help you out. Um, I will give you some shocking news. I have scaled it back this year, believe it or not. Um, <laughs> I'm usually way over the top. If you go watch last year's videos, you'll know that I buy way too many gifts and my kids honestly end up only playing with about half of them and the rest of them just sit there. And so I vowed after that happened last year that I was scaling back this year and I have. So if you get your kids a bajillion presents, I feel you. If that's what you want to do, you go ahead and you do that because that has always been me until this year. I still got a lot, but it's like probably half the amount of gifts that I bought last year, which is crazy. But um, if you're excited, stay tuned. And as I said, this is going to be part of a series. I'll be doing videos for what I got my five-year-old Landon, what I got my three-year-old Fisher, and then I will also be doing a video of all of our stocking stuffers and our Christmas Eve box gift. So four videos total. This is the first one. Let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that Addison asked for this year were these big squishy pillow animals. She saw them at Target and she loved them and she wanted all of them. And so I've got her several. The first one that I got her is this one. It is a big like unicorn, but it's also kind of like, I don't know. It looks like a mix between a pig and a cow. <laughs> I'm not sure what animal it is. Maybe it's just a unicorn, but it is so soft and so squishy. This is not one of the scented ones, but she saw this at Target and when she saw the like shelf of these, she wanted every single one. So I did go back and I got her several of them. She's not into dolls or Barbies. She never has been, but she has always loved stuffed animals, which is annoying because they take up so much space, but she loves them. So this is her first gift, a big squishy pink tie dye unicorn that she can put in her room and snuggle with on her bed and I know she's gonna love him and he was from Target like I said gift number one done the second squishy that I got her was from Justice very similar to the ones at Target but she had she hasn't ever seen this one so I, I like to get things that she's picked out and I also like to get things that she's never seen so she can be a little more like surprised. So I found this one at Justice and it is a big leopard print cat and he's got all different color little almost like paint splatters on him and he's so soft just like the other one um, and I think he's really cute. He's got this long curly tail and he's gonna be very soft and snuggly on her bed as well. So that's her second gift. Two more squishies. 
These are both from Target and I thought they would be cute in her room. Right now she has a Jojo Siwa comforter on her bed and it's got like cupcakes and donuts and ice cream cones on it. And I saw these and I thought she would really like them and that they would look cute on her bed. The first one is a donut and on one side it's pink and blue and then on the other side it's blue with sprinkles and again it's really squishy this one feels more like a bean bag almost but super soft and squishy um and so i thought that would be really cute <sighs> i'm already out of breath and we just got started not a good sign <laughs> but i got her this one and then to go with it i also got a chocolate chip m m cookie how cute are these? I'm really excited for her to get these because this is just the kind of thing that she loves. Up next is the only gift that I don't have actually to show you guys in person. Um, and it is a Delta Wing scooter. Um, this is something that a little girl on our street has and Addison always like watches her ride hers down the street and she just thinks it's so cool. And, um, it's in our attic, I do have it, but when it got delivered, it just came in a big cardboard box. It doesn't even have like the picture of the scooter on the box for me to show you. So I didn't bring it down, but I will insert a picture of what it looks like here. So I think she's gonna be really excited uh, to get her Delta Wing scooter, and that is gonna be one of her bigger gifts this year. Um, and I really hope she likes it um, because it's cool. Like you kind of you have two pedals to put your feet on, and you kind of have to like move your body from side to side to make it go. So I don't know. I thought that would be a fun gift for her and something to get her like outdoors and being a little bit active. Okay, the next thing that I got Addie were these Jojo Siwa scoot scooters. I think I was gonna say sneakers. These Jojo Siwa shoes, high top shoes, they've got big old bows on the front and they're tie dye and they're super cute. These were from Walmart and I sadly bought these like a couple weeks ago and then I saw that they went on sale on Black Friday for 10 bucks so I may have to like take my receipt up there and see if they'll give me the difference because 10 bucks was a really good deal um, but you can see they say Jojo and they had all different ones like different patterns and colors but I thought these were just cool and different so I grabbed her these and I hope she really likes them. She still is into Jojo, but not as much as she was last year. Um, but I just thought these were cute and they would like look cute with her school uniforms. So I grabbed her these. Next up is something Addison asked for. I was really surprised when she asked for this because it's kind of like, it's been around for ever and I never knew that she would ever want it. And it is, Candyland. <laughs> I played this when I was a kid. I loved this game, um, but I didn't know that this would be something that she would want. And score, it was only like maybe five bucks. So that was a win, a really cheap gift, and it's something that she actually wanted. So I grabbed her this game, and hopefully we can all like play it as a family and have some fun. Okay, next up, I saw these, I've seen them at Target, I've seen them at Walmart, um, and I didn't really know what they were, so I looked up a YouTube video to see um, what it was all about, and I thought they were cute, so I went ahead and got her one. She did not ask for this, so I hope she likes it, um, but it is a rainbow corn sequin surprise. And it's like one of those big mystery eggs where you like crack it open and there's a surprise inside. And like you can see that there's like sequins right here. And I think whenever you open the egg up, there's a stuffed animal inside and the sequins are on its belly. So it kind of is going to look like one of these and you don't know which animal you're going to get. And 
I don't know about your kids, but my kids are all about the surprise bags, the surprise eggs, anything where it's a surprise, they love that. So I think that she'll like this. Um, we will see, but I thought it was cute and something for her to be surprised about for Christmas. So I got it. Next up, if you've watched any, any of my videos before, you may know that Addison does competitive cheerleading. So I wanted to get her a couple of cheer gifts this year. So when her cheer gym started selling these, it was the perfect thing for me to get for her. And it is a Sherpa jacket that says, like has her cheer, gym name on there. It says Rock Solid Elite Cheer. And this is where she cheers at and it's a cute little Sherpa and it's even got pockets. I thought that was so cute. Um, her cheer competition season is about to start. We have our first competition in a couple weeks or even like a week and a half from now. Um, which is really exciting and of course cheer is in the winter and so this will be something really cute that she can wear like over her uniform to and from the competitions and to practices and that kind of thing so i thought this was really cute and i hope she loves it i think she will and to go with it i also ordered her these um, which they are a pair of rse cheer slides um, I thought these were really cute and they even put her name on there for me. So they say Addison um, and of course her cheer shoes are solid white and so it's really hard to keep them clean. So we try to only wear them inside. Um, so these will be perfect for her to like slide in to with like her socks on and then to wear whenever we're walking around like the competitions or like to and from the car, et cetera, et cetera. You know what I mean? But anyway, it was just cute that they had these for sale. They say her gym on there and they even have her name. So I'm gonna wrap these and the Sherpa jacket together and hopefully that'll be a really nice cheer gift for her. I'm excited about those. Next up, I saw this at Target a long time ago. In fact, this is one of the very first things that I bought for Christmas this year. Addison has one onesie like a, that she wears as pajamas um, and she loves it. She loves wearing a onesie. I don't know why. She's eight years old, but she's obsessed. And whenever her one onesie is dirty, she's always like begging me to wash it so she can wear it again. Um, so I got her a new onesie. I saw this one at Target and it is mermaid. Like to me, this looks like a mermaid. I don't know why. I guess because it has like little scale like things on it and it is like colored kind of tie dye like a mermaid. I don't know, but um, it's really soft. So soft. It almost feels like a blanket. Um, but I got her this for her to wear around and sleep in and I know she's gonna love it because she loves her other onesie so much. So I got her a new one in a bigger size. So hopefully it will last a long time. Um, but to go with it, since it's kind of on the mermaid theme, I also got her this. <laughs> This is a mermaid tail blanket. So I kind of ripped this cardboard out of there somehow. But it's just a big snuggly like sleeping bag blanket that you get inside and you look like a mermaid. How cute is this? I would have been obsessed with this when I was eight years old because I'm obsessed with it now and I'm 32 years old. So it's just so cute. <laughs> and I thought she could wear like her mermaid onesie and get into her mermaid sequin blanket and just be so snuggly and cute. And the back is just super soft, like fluffy, snuggly 
Oh, I love it. And the inside, of course, is just the soft material too, but I thought that was super cute. I can't pass up a sparkle. I love anything that sparkles and I love this blanket. So, oh, and I didn't say where I got it from. I found this at Marshall's, which if you haven't thought about going to Marshall's for Christmas for your kids, they have some really cute things and they even have some cute toys that are like way cheaper than what you would find at the main store. So maybe check out Marshall's if you haven't, but that's where I got this blanket and I think it was like 20 bucks. So I thought that was a good gift. Okay, next up, I got this for Addison on Black Friday. It was something that I'd had my eye on for her for a while. I kind of went back and forth on whether I thought that she would love it or not. But then when I saw that it was on sale on Black Friday, I went ahead and grabbed her one. And it is a Polaroid camera. And this one is actually a bundle. And so it comes with, oh, and I picked purple. They have pink, purple, white, and like a turquoise blue color. Um, but Addie loves purple. And so I got her the purple one. It's really cute. Um, and it comes with the camera a little like carrying bag that has a strap so you can like wear your camera like a purse and carry it around with you. And then it comes with a little like photo album for you to put your Polaroids in. It comes with an extra pack of film, which is really nice. And then I think it also comes with these little like photo holders that she could like put in her room. So I grabbed her that. It is the Insta. The X Fuji Film Mini 7S Polaroid Camera. Could that have any more adjectives? I don't think so. <laughs> but I thought that she would enjoy this. It's kind of an older gift, um, but she is she's kind of getting to that age where she's starting to like older kid things and less toys. So um, I had to kind of be creative, but I think that she'll have fun with this. She can take pictures um, with her cheer friends with this, like at her competitions um, and stuff like that. And so I think she'll be excited to have this. I would be, I think it's a cool gift. Next up, this is really cool. I got her one of these and I also got the boys a joint one, which you will see in the next video if you watch it. Um, but there is a website called Hooray Heroes. And I just, I actually think that I stumbled upon this website from an Instagram ad, <laughs> surprisingly enough. Um, but it's really cool. And they do custom books. For your kids and so I ordered her this book and it's called when Addison grows up and you get to like put your kids name and your kids your child's name is all throughout the book like every single page it has their name in the story and you even get to customize the character to look like your child which is so fun and then like all the illustrations look like your child so it's basically a custom book about your child with their name in it that you can read to them. And I thought that was so cool. And this one is all about like what she might be when she grows up. And I even got to like, they had a big list of all the different like jobs she might have. And I got to choose which ones I wanted in the story. So there's like an astronaut or a doctor or a vet or, um, like a, a rock star. I don't know. It was just really cute and cool. I got to pick like her hair color, her skin tone, her eye color, her hairstyle, all kinds of stuff like that to try to make it look like her. And I'm really excited to read this to her. So you may want to check out this website. Um, as a really like cool and different and thoughtful gift. I feel like it's it's special because it's so custom. Um, but yeah, I'm, I can't open it because it's in this like wrap to show you guys all the pages, but it was really cute. And it even lets you preview every single page to see if you like, like if you want that in your story. But anyway, I got her this book and I thought that was a really cute 
fun gift. Okay, next up, I grabbed these for Addison on Black Friday as well, and they are some wireless headphones. Addie does have her own cell phone. Her dad got it for her for her birthday this last year, which was after Christmas. Um, but don't worry, I have it heavily restricted and heavily monitored, and she basically only uses it to play games that I have pre-approved and to watch YouTube kid videos. Um, and then she can like text and call me and her grandma. But <laughs> so she does have her own phone and I got her these wireless headphones, which were on sale on Black Friday. Um, they're just black. I know that they make like really cute girly ones, but these were a good deal on Black Friday. And it does say that they're supposed to have 30 hours of battery life, which I thought was really good. So I grabbed her these. I thought she could like, you know, watch her videos without being disturbed or without disturbing me. Um, <laughs> so I just thought that would be a good gift for her um, for Christmas. So I got her those on Black Friday at Walmart. I think they were $15, by the way. I don't know if I said that. Um, yeah. Next up, I got all three of my kids one of these. Spoiler alert. Target was having a deal where all Nerf products were buy two, get one free. And since I have three kids, I thought that was a pretty good deal. So I grabbed all three of my kids one of these little tiny Fortnite nerf guns landon my five-year-old is really the kid in the family who's into that kind of thing but i get him those and then every single time addison is like jealous that she doesn't have one too and then landon doesn't really have anyone to play the guns with because she's the only one with one so i thought if i get them all one they can shoot each other <laughs> and play together so i got addy this cute like llama one um which was the girliest one because it's purple and it's a llama. So grabbed her that and I'm gonna give her that for Christmas. Two more things guys and we're done. Can you believe it? Are you proud of me? Oh no, no, I lied. <laughs> Three more things and we're done. The next thing is something that Addie did ask for. I probably never would have picked this out for her had she not asked for it. But since she did, I went ahead and got it. And it is a really rad robot. Um, and this one is Oh. It's called the Turbo Bot. I think he's supposed to go really fast and he like does follows voice commands. It says that he dances, he tells jokes, and he responds to your voice. So this is something she wanted. Like I said, she's not always a really girly girl. She doesn't like dolls and stuff. She's into stuff like this, <laughs> So, which is okay with me. So I got her this. I hope she enjoys it. It comes with like a remote control and you can like control them. I don't know. I hope he's fun, cause she's getting him. <laughs> okay, and I saved the best two gifts for last. They're her two main gifts, I would say. And the very number one thing that she's asking for this year <sighs> is something that's probably gonna break her neck. But I got her one anyway. Fingers crossed it won't destroy my house or destroy her. And it is ugh, a hoverboard. <laughs> oh, she has been begging me for a hoverboard for months and months. When I ask her what she wants for Christmas, it's literally the first thing she says every single time. Um, so I got her one. I got this one. Um, it's kind of like a hot pink fuchsia e color, and it does have like LED lights that light up right here. 
and it also has Bluetooth, so I think it plays music, which is cool. Um, and so I hope that she doesn't destroy all the walls in my house with this. Um, but this is like her main gift and I ordered this on Amazon. So this is uh, her big gift this year. Okay, last but not least, the very last gift that she's getting this year for Under the Tree is something I had zero intention <laughs> of getting for her. But when I went Black Friday shopping, I saw them and I thought, hmm, that could be a really cool thing for her um, to have. And it was a really good deal on Black Friday. So I ended up getting her. Oh. <laughs> a Roku TV. So this is a TV that she'll get to have in her room. We'll set it up for her and maybe, I don't know if we'll mount it or she has like this big table thing at the end of her bed. We may put it on there, but it'll be just for her in her room. Oh, hold on. And it is for streaming. So we don't even have cable at our house. We have Netflix and we have Disney Plus now, which is super exciting and amazing. So she will be able to watch, you know, like her Netflix shows um, and then also Disney Plus shows in her room, which will also be heavily monitored, don't worry. And also a time limit and curfew set on, don't worry. But I think she'll be super excited to open this. Like who wouldn't be super excited to get their own TV? Um, so I think that this is a really good find. It was only $98 on Black Friday at Walmart and it's a 40 inch Roku TV. So I think she's gonna love it. Um, like I said, I did scale back on the number of gifts this year, but I'm really happy with everything that I picked and I think that she will be too. And I think that it's still plenty. So if you have opinions that aren't very nice about anything that I got or the amount of stuff that I got, you can just keep it to yourself. <laughs> because I don't want to hear it. <laughs> you are welcome to do Christmas however you want or don't want to, and so am I. So let's just be positive and choose joy and spread joy to others, and let's all have a really Merry Christmas. Anyway, please stay tuned and check out my upcoming videos which are gift giving for my five-year-old, gift giving guide for my three-year-old, and also our stocking stuffers and Christmas Eve box videos. All coming very, very soon. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I would really, really appreciate it. I love making videos for you guys. I love hearing from you guys, hearing about all the things that you are gonna buy your kids for Christmas. Please let me know down in the comments. I truly want to know. Okay, I'm gonna stop rambling. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you really soon with another video. Bye!